Captain Renslow had apparently mishandled one of the most elemental piloting maneuvers. How to recover from a stall. Above everything, it requires gaining airspeed to get out of the red. The recovery procedure is fairly simple and straightforward. It requires pushing forward on the controls and adding full power. At any point in time, had the captain pushed forward on those flight controls, he had a reasonably good chance of recovering quickly. From everything we've gained, that stall was recoverable on a repeated number of levels on a repeated basis. There was no reason for that plane to go down. Investigators also learned that First Officer Shaw, in trying to help Renslow deal with the crisis, inadvertently made things worse. I put the flaps up! She retracted the flaps, reducing the amount of lift as the plane struggled to stay in the air. Had the First Officer simply called out, you're stalled, advance the power, push the nose over, the airplane would have been able to recover. From a human point of view, it's sad to recognize that those sorts of things happened and the, the tragedy that came from that. It's concluded that Captain Renslow's failure to properly respond to the stall warning was the primary cause of the crash of Flight 3407.